Why cite? Citing your sources is an important component of college-level work for a number of reasons. Some are practical, some are more theoretical. One practical reason to cite your sources is to provide more information to your readers. It's impossible, and probably impractical, to cover everything about a topic in a paper or project. There are undoubtedly going to be things you just have to leave out. Having a cited works list, though, will allow your readers to find more information about what you've explained in your work. Citing sources also lends credibility to your work. It shows that the ideas aren't just something you made up, but that you have evidence that verifies your positions, statements, and so on. Including citations in your research also shows your audience the evolution of ideas and research. For example, you're basing your work on the work of others who might have taken a different approach to it. Your reader can then find out what your sources said and follow up on the sources that your sources used. On a theoretical level, when you're writing or creating information as part of your classes, you're taking part in the scholarly dialogue. You're working with, commenting on, and building upon the ideas of those who came before you. If your work gets published, your work will become part of the building materials for others' work, and so on. Citing your sources makes this activity transparent. Students, and sometimes even professional researchers, are charged with plagiarism when they use the work of others as the basis of their own work and don't credit their sources. Sometimes this plagiarism is intentional, and sometimes it's accidental. In general, if you quote, summarize, or paraphrase what someone else has said, or if you reuse someone else's ideas, you need to cite the source. If you'd like more details about citing sources, please see the tutorial, How Do I Cite My Sources? For other questions, please contact a librarian.